Yo, what up guys, Jacques Slade back with another unboxing and uh, this time I have no idea what this is. Well, I, no, I'll take that back. I know it's something from Nike. Uh, so Nike contacted me and said, uh, asked me for my address and uh, this is the package that showed up in the mail. Uh, the box is a little beat up and it's actually, actually pretty heavy. Uh, I'm not sure what's in here, uh, but you're not here to stare at the box. So let's hop right inside and see what we have here. This box is taped up really well because what's inside of it is really heavy. Shout out to the X-Acto knife that I use for my custom sneakers. Um, so whatever is in here is pretty heavy. Um, I don't know if that means it's more than one pair of shoes or just one pair of shoes or if it's, maybe it's not even shoes. Maybe it's a laptop, maybe it's a computer. Or I don't know, I don't know what it is. But let's take a look inside. I imagine it's shoes, some, some more, bunch of bubble wrap. And here we go. Let's see if I can get this out of here. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh. Wait, is there more? Well, there's keys. There's keys to whatever this is. I think I have it upside down. Yeah. Because I guess the keys are supposed to be the keys are supposed to be in here, but they fell out. Let me make sure there's nothing in there. Yeah, that's empty. All right, let's uh, cut this open. Let's see here. Goodness, I put this tape on here really well. I leave a lot of protection because it's so heavy, which makes sense. But it just gives me a hard time to get it out of the package. All right. All right there we go. Let's roll this out, I guess. <laughs> roll it out. Hopefully I'm not messing something up here. All right. This is a lot of bubble wrap. Oh. Okay, so ah, I know what this is. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. I know what this is. So if you've uh, been following Nike's account on, uh, on Twitter, uh, which you probably should, the Nike basketball account, they've been, oh, goodness gracious. They tweeted out a picture, uh, a tweet of this. Uh, so check that out. That is really dope. So basically it's a locker uh, for the launch of the Kyrie 2. It's this uh, special edition locker. So these won't be available to the public. At least I don't think they are. Um, so it's just like a little fire. It's like a fire hydrant. Uh, what they keep the uh, fire extinguisher in. That is pretty cool. And it has the Kyrie 2. It says uh, contents flammable. Then it has like the match, it has a fire extinguisher, actual fire, and then a person playing basketball running with their shoes on fire. Uh, so the Kyrie Inferno unexpected move number 86 danger may cause spontaneous combustion and heat checks. Very cool. So let's take the, uh, the keys and take a look inside. Hopefully these keys work. Yes, they do. Oh my gosh, this is really heavy. This is really heavy. Really well done, Nike. Uh, this is um, two, limited edition, four of six. Wow, thank you. Wow, thank you. Uh, I, wow, that's huge. Uh, the Kyrie Inferno uh, maintenance record. It is my duty to inform you the Kyrie 2s in this limited edition package are the hottest Kyrie 2s ever known to mankind. The Kyrie Inferno's limited edition, four of six, two Jacques Slade. Warning, the Kyrie Inferno's will not spontaneously combust, but you can cause spontaneous speed and the ability to look fresh. If your Kyrie Infernos do spontaneously combust, that would be crazy and you should probably get that checked out. Kyrie Irving and Nike are not responsible for any embarrassment inflicted on opponents while wearing Kyrie Infernos. The attached key will unlock your Kyrie Infernos. Use them to unleash your own unexpectedness on the court. Bring your game. Uh, then it's signed by Kyrie Irving Fire Marshal. That is pretty cool. Uh, thank you, uh, Nike and Kyrie Irving. That's awesome i like wow i'm blown away so let's let's actually take a look at the shoes um i'll give you guys a closer look at the locker in just a second this thing is really heavy oh my gosh so here is the Kyrie 2 inferno uh for those um that have been following the story of the shoes um have this hyperfuse upper there's a a, a mesh 
They have mesh here as well. Um, they have the midfoot strap, which helps keep you locked in. And something about the Kyrie, because obviously Kyrie is a guard, and most of you guys know uh, that that's the position he plays, that uh, Leo Chang, who actually designed these, he did some extra work on the midsole and outsole. Um, the story of the Kyrie 2 is about how quick he is and how hard he stops and his impact and the, and the pressures and Newton's laws of, of force versus energy. And so he has a rounded edge here on all uh, on the outsole and midsole that goes right medial side and on the lateral side as well. And you see it here as well. You see it here well. You see it a little bit here on, on the heel for the outsole. And that's because Kyrie stays so low and moves to the ground so low that Leo Chang felt it was necessary to round off these edges so that when he stopped and his foot started to roll over a little bit, he would still have that traction. It wouldn't be like a sharp edge, like a general, like a regular basketball tennis shoe for him to start falling over. This would give Give him still this ability to have some more traction so the traction that you see here is very similar to the usual herringbone traction that you see but it's been modified um, to fit Kyrie's game and then you see you see that it has the large uh, concentric circles right here uh, just gives Kyrie a larger surface to when he's cutting and, and cutting around obviously they have the Kyrie logos right here which are always really nice um, and I believe the official color is bright crimson and black we have Kyrie's number here on the heel, number two. And then I saw this online uh, when I saw these, uh, when they announced these, is that the inside has Kyrie's signature and it also has JBY. Uh, it means just be you, which is Kyrie's way of saying, you know, I just want to remain humble and just play the sport of basketball and, you know, not let anything get in my head. So just be you and be who you are. So pretty cool. Uh, wow, let me grab the uh, locker. Or I don't even know if this is officially called. Is this a locker or a fire extinguisher case? I don't know, some, one of those two. Anyway, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick look at this uh, unboxing. Uh, the Kyrie 2s are actually available now. Uh, if you want to grab those, they're over on Nike.com. I have a link down in the description. They're $120, which is a pretty good deal for basketball shoes considering uh, how much some other shoes cost. So check these out. Uh, they, they do not come with this. Uh, thank you again to Nike and to Kyrie. Uh, really appreciate it. This is really, really awesome. Uh, I love this. Uh, if you haven't already, make sure you like, favorite, and subscribe and all that good stuff. If you're not already, follow me over on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. It's all under the name Cousteau. I am Jacques Slade. This is a quick unboxing of the Kyrie 2 Inferno with the um, fire extinguisher. I don't know what this is called. The container. Fire extinguisher container. Locker stuff. I don't know. Anyway, hope you guys have a great weekend. I'll see you soon. Peace. The inspiration started back with Kobe's love for soccer and soccer shoes and continues today in this version. However, there is no need to worry about the shoe and about it being low because the heel counter is there and that's where you receive your support are starting to make some major moves. Like last year, this list is my personal top 10. So some of these I own and some of them I don't. So with that said, let's get right to it.